Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Chrono Cross. Board your boat. Alright, we're going to the Isle of the Damned. We got a letter. Bring Karsh or else. So although Bishy McSephiroth has not been too nice to us up to this point, we're going to have to endure him for just a little while. And we remember this place, right? Just when you think. <laughs> just when you think you're done here. It's never over. Oh, and there's probably something I wanted to mention. Well, I, I, you know what? I don't care. <laughs> I should care. I'll, I'll tell you about it when we get there. So here we are again. The good news is, is we don't have to do any of the crazy crap we did before. Like opening the walls and figuring everything out. It's the same exact path as before. So there's really nothing to do but just run through and uh, avoid enemies. So let's do that. I don't think we're gonna have time to get everything in here, but you know, I'll try. Basically take the same exact path as you're going to Garai, the way we went before. So through the bones, and you'll come out on the left-hand side, and you're gonna have to use Garai's keepsake again to get through the mirror. Same as before. And there shouldn't be anything in here, noteworthy anyway. So just go the same way. I love what is coming up, I really do. I feel so sorry for people that have skipped this and not seen this. There they are! The two retards yet again, just when you thought you wouldn't see them anymore. So Sir Karsh, you actually shook it here! Do you knowingly know why we are here? Hell no! What? Am I supposed to? Don't shake ignorance! We came to investigate what happened here. Sir Karsh, we have stood by your side, unable to shake loose this one suspicion we had. Suspicion? We believe you may have killed Sir Dario. And by shaking it here, our suspicion has turned to conviction. So Sir Karsh, we are executing you for the murder of Sir Dario. Dario. We remember a little bit about him in the beginning. I love this cutscene, you guys. I really do. How's your training going, everyone? Miss Riddell! I brought something special for everyone today. Oh, really? What is it? What is it? Viper churros? Wrong answer, Glenn. Next? Are they really that good? Uh-huh. I can chomp down ten of those easily. Haha, <laughs> you're always like that. Those churros were originally iron rations for knights. Overeating is not good discipline. So, Miss Riddell, what have you brought us? Please don't make us hold our breath too long. This is it. I found it in Fossil Valley. Isn't it pretty? Ah, oh, shoot, it's just a flower. Miss Riddell, did you go to the valley by yourself? What, I'm not allowed to? It's just the valley. I'm sure it's safe enough. I have enough for everyone. I'll give some to you boys. Glenn doesn't want any, right? Since you've gone through the trouble of getting it, I'll take one too. If I plant its seeds, I might get some good fruit from it. Oh, how silly of you, Glenn. Oh, so we see them all as young children growing up. Here you go, Glenn. But I don't think it'll grow any fruit, though. You don't know until you try. Karsh might not like things like flowers, but... N no, it's not that. You brought me one too. This is beautiful. What kind of flower could this be? It's a bell flower. Miss Riddell, if you ever wish for this flower, I will go for you instead. If anything should happen to you, then let us go together. Does that sound like a good idea? Yes, very well. Oh, I think Karsh has never received a flower before. Karsh? Are you listening? Huh? Oh, sorry. So what is it? What's with the formality? 
Uh, um, how should I? A actually, I... Why are you acting so strange? Spit it out. I, 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 to tell you the truth... Karsh, we are pledged to marry. I have already told Daddy about it. Th that is what I wanted to tell you. Will you bless us with your approval, Karsh? M marry? So that's it. Well, congratulations. When's it gonna be? And where? We haven't decided on a date yet. We still need to finish surveying the Isle of the Damned first. It's just that... Just what? I want the wedding here. The place where we have cried together, laughed together, and shared our dreams together. You never change, Dario. Hey, then I'll have to fill this dull vacant lot with loads of bellflowers. Just tell me if I can help you in any way. Thank you, Karsh. Oh, but you know what? Poor guy. That's so sad. We have a newfound respect for, uh, for Mr. Bishop and Sephiroth, I think, don't we? This must be it. Karsh, why are you in such a hurry? The enemy is not going anywhere, and the footing here is bad. Why do you always have to be like that, Dario? The Masamune may be in there. Any Dragoon would be hyped to see that thing, you know? Hmm, something feels wrong here. Shaker Brothers, you stay here. Sir! This is Sir! Let's get going, Dario. Fine. I don't like the feeling of this. Something's wrong. Is that the Masamune? Whoa, whoa, boy. Oh, man. Did he just axe him? Was I really just possessed by that devilish sword? Driven by such intense hatred and envy. Maybe deep inside me, I was filled with hatred? Dario, the one whom I could never beat, no matter how much I tried. The one who stole Riddell's heart from me. What if that sword does not embed hatred into the mind of its wielder, but instead draws out and ignites the flames of hatred hidden within the hearts of men? And if that hatred was something deep within the wielder to begin with? Then what if I... Oh man, but we've, saw, we've seen that once before. The Masamune took over Radius when he killed Garai. And then Karsh was taken over and killed Garai's son. Wow, that's amazing. So you do know something about it! Take it easy! Why the hell do I have to fight you guys? No time for questions! Ugh, what the hell? What the hell indeed, and I don't think we're gonna go on right now because I don't have time to fight them, but when we come back... The Shaker Brothers. Final battle. What'll happen? <laughs> See you later, guys.